hi everyone and welcome in the previous videos we have seen that how we can read modbus serial device data in the python but in all the previous videos we are reading modbus serial device data in the python from any modbus simulator but right now i have this device okay so this is the md02 uh, this is the serial uh, transmitter Morbus serial transmitter which is providing temperature and humidity data okay so I have connected this device with this ATC converter and this ATC converter is connected with my laptop okay and it is connected on the COM3 port okay so in the Python we are going to read the temperature and humidity data of this device so I have already written the Python script as you can see here so instead of uh, pi modbus in this script we are going to use the minimal modbus okay so if minimal modbus is not installing your system then you can run this command to install minimal modbus package in your system so you can see it's running here okay you can see requirement already satisfied so it is already installed in my system after that we have to import a minimal modbus library to read the data from this uh, modbus transmitter device okay so import is done after that we have to define the serial port parameter or you can say we have to define um, this device parameter okay so this device is connected with my laptop via atc converter on the com3 port so that is why uh, you can see here i have defined com3 here the baud rate of this device is 9600 the stop bit is 1 uh, data bits 8 or you can say byte size 8 and parity is none okay after that we have to create the object okay so instrument is equal to minimal modbus dot instrument and the port number so port number is com3 and the slave address so th this device is having a slave address or you can say device id is one so if you have another device which is having different slave id then you can also specify that here okay so if your device id is having a slave id of eight then you can specify eight here after that uh, we have to set the parameters okay so board rate is the board rate okay you can see board rate is 9600 byte size 8 stop bit 1 and the parity none so we have defined in our uh, instrument object okay so we have added everything into instrument object after that we want to read temperature and humidity data from this device okay and this device is providing temperature and humidity data on 30001 and 30002 okay it's a input register okay so here i have write one single line that values is equal to instrument dot read register i want to read the register from one i want to read two register okay and function code is four so function code is four it means we are going to read the data of input register so if i open my more scan then you can see function code 4 is associated with the input register so that is why i have used the function code 4 here okay after that whatever value i'm getting the first value will be my temperature and the second value will be my humidity and after that i am uh, dividing it by 10 because uh, we are getting the row value as you can see here we are getting the row value 335501 this is not the actual value so to convert that into the actual value i have to divide it by 10 and then i am closing the serial connection okay so let me uh, restart my kernel okay we will restart and clear all output so we will restart and clear all output of all cell and then we will uh, run all the cells one by one okay so kernel is ready let me run this okay it is fine fine okay now we are going to read the values so whenever i run this okay whenever i run this cell you will see some blink here okay you will see some blink on the atc converter okay so you will see some blink on the atc converter yeah you got the blink right so it has read the data from this device okay now we are extracting the data from uh, values object okay and we are printing the values here you can see 27.6 degree centigrade is, is the temperature and the 44.1 is the percentage relative humidity you can also write a while loop to read it continuously after reading the temperature and humidity data you can also integrate uh, mqtt protocol okay so you can transfer this data to any mqtt broker and you can also read that data in your phone or in any devices okay so that is also possible so this is how you can 
use your python to read uh, any data from your modbus serial device okay so this is my modbus serial device and this is the atc converter instead of atc converter you can also use a uh, usb to serial converter okay uh, let me search it okay so you can also use this type of uh, usb to rs485 converter okay and right now i'm in india so it this cost around one dollar okay and if you go for you know wave share product then it will cost you a lot more but this is fine you can read any data any sensor data of uh, uh, rs485 compatible sensor using this uh, serial to uh, um, usb converter okay so this is the code okay we are reading the temperature and humidity data from this device and this code will be available on our github repository okay so you can uh, navigate to this uh, github repository open opc pi morbus snap 7 mqtt you can navigate to morbus folder and in the morbus folder you will find uh, so many folders okay in the library name so in the minimal morbus folder you will see this code okay you can directly download it from here uh, download row file and you can directly use it okay and based on your configuration you can uh, change the com port you can change the ball rate you can change the stop beat byte size everything okay so i hope this is clear to you okay so if you have any doubt any question or any concern then you can ping me on whatsapp telegram instagram anywhere and i'll try to resolve your doubt as soon as possible okay and after i mean after reading the data you can also in log this data into sql database okay so that is also possible so i hope uh, that thing is clear to you now we will meet you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you